Howdy folks, uh, this is a quick test of some retracks off Hobby King. These are the servoless retracks with a metal trunnion for large models and the ID number is 22500020. Now they state that these are for models ranging from 10 to 12 kilos, I'm not sure that I'd use them for anything that big. I am going to put them in a fairly modified FMS P51 that I'm hoping weighs about 6 kilos so um, hopefully they're more than up to the job for that but when I first received them I did some testing just with my fingers to see if I could stop the legs going up and down and while they would stop when I had my finger there holding them in place um, they just kept going again once I let my finger go so I was worried that the safety switch wasn't working I did some more testing tonight and found that it's about a six second delay from when the retract actually stops and then the switch kicks in and, and turns the unit off. So I just wanted to do some quick tests and show you how many amps the units were draw, drawing going up and down. So here we go. Okay, so about 0.3 amps going either way seems to be what they are regularly doing obviously with some legs and wheels on there it's going to uh, be a little bit different but um, that's what we've got all right so this is my little device here it's just in case both retracks happen to get blocked by something going up or down There we go, and the switch has kicked in, so it's taken a fair bit longer than I would expect for that switch to kick in and turn those off, but anyway, it's worked, which I'm happy about. These retracks are very, very, very strong. It takes quite a lot if you put your finger in the way for the retract to stop moving, so um, yeah, anyway, and then click the switch, and off they go again. So, uh, they seem to be okay to me, but... Um, I put the receiver in the background there because I was just seeing how far, or oh, just to make sure that the um, receiver didn't brown out with that many amps being drawn from the, both units at once. I will be running a separate battery on these, separate to the flight pack for the rest of the plane, just in case for any reason something goes wrong with the retracks. The servos are being used at the same time, pull too many amps get a brown out so there we go um, all up for I think the 23 or 24 US dollars I paid for them they seem to be okay so there you go